Welcome to another episode. Sorry. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Flip It Friday, the show where we take our old stuff and we flip it into something new. I'm your host, Daniela Dawkins, and today I have a freaking awesome, oh, I'm shaking, because it's so freaking, so freaking awesome. I have an awesome flip for you guys. Before we jump into the video, I'm going to ask you guys, like this video because you're going to love it. Like, like it because you're going to love it. So just like it from the beginning and click share so that someone else can, you know, see what one and flip their stuff into something new and make it all fresh and fabulous. Also, put the notification bell on because then you will never miss an episode of Flip It Friday. You know, hopefully you never will. And add in the comments what you'd like to see me make next time because that would be friggin' awesome. Anyway, without further ado, let's jump into the video and yeah, roll it out. Oh my God, guys, you don't know how excited I am to show you this upcycle challenge that I done. I took these ski pants and I made them into a high-waisted skirt and it is just freaking awesome. I can't wait to wear it. Basically, all you want to do is get your pants, you want to cut off as much as you want to cut off to make it as short as you want and you're going to open the inside seam from and because it's lined make sure you do it to the lining and the outside and then just kind of mess about with it see how you want it to lay and then pin it in place so that you're basically ready to take it to the sewing machine once you're done pinning sew it up at this point you could use fabric glue or you could hand stitch if you don't have a sewing machine but to be honest it is better to sew it because it's just going to be tighter cut off the access you don't need any of that stuff and you could just hem it up at that point but i made it a little bit shorter because i felt it was too long and then i overlocked it so that it's just neater and especially because it's lined those two pieces stay together once you've over overlocked it you're just gonna pin it in place, pin a hem on it, and then stitch that hem down so it lays flat. You could add a trim to it if you want, you could make it girly and add some lace, but I left it there, I was so happy with it. So, those ski pants, I swear they cost me, I'm sure they're about, I got two, I got a black pair and then I got a blue pair um, a different day. So I can't remember whether they were six pounds or eight pounds, but they were awesome. I love things that are high-waisted. So as soon as I tried them on, I was just like, oh, these are mine. And I knew exactly that I was gonna make them into a skirt. However, I didn't know that I was gonna be able to make a top and a bag with it as well. So I wouldn't wear um, the, the skirt, dungaree skirt with the top together however that's two separate outfits right there and a bag just in case like I don't I absolutely can't find a bag to go with it like how freaking awesome is that here's me styling it and yeah let me know what you think I mean, I know exactly where I'd wear that outfit. Like, once summer pops and we're allowed back outside and to travel, there's good. There's gonna be so many day parties. That's 100% a day party outfit. Pop it on with some cute little trainers. I only really wear like canvas trainers, so like Converse would be cool. My shoe game is so whack, but you know, I think I'm due a new pair of Converse this year. So yeah, I think that's the whole vibe. Um, what would you wear it with then? Let me know. What shoes would you wear it with? Would you dress it up? Would you dress it down? Would you wear it out, out, or would you wear it out? Let me know if you know what out, out, and out is. This is they're totally different places. And, um, yeah. Boom. Well, I hope you enjoyed that episode of Flip It Friday. This blue outfit is got to be by far my favourite. And I know I probably say that when I make, every time I make something, but seriously, that's got to be one of my favourites. Um, remember to like this video, 
Remember to share this video because everyone needs to know that they are in control of their wardrobe. They can make their own stuff. Like, come on, we can do this. If you haven't got a sewing machine and you want to learn how to sew, hit me up. Obviously, I can't come to you, but we can, we can jump online. If you're interested in sewing, I say buy yourself a sewing machine and let's go from there. However, if you're like bun sewing, I'm not even about that life. Fabric glue is good. If you click the details, I will list the fabric glue that I get in there. And if you buy it, like, yeah, I get a commission, but I ain't getting paid to do this. So, you know, come on, help a girl out. Hit the notification bell. Remember I told you, cause you don't want to miss a video. Like, listen, shit's popping off in it. Like, I'm preparing for summer. I'm preparing for my holiday at the end of the year. I, I plan to have my whole wardrobe handmade like boom let's do this if you want to be on this journey with me make sure you join me join me over on my instagram because i do a lot more videos i can roll them out a lot quicker there and up on my youtube it, the longer videos are here but if you want to see the quick flips you can follow me on tiktok and you can follow me on instagram and that's where i post most of my stuff without further ado do i don't say that at the end of this one do i do you know what? Have an amazing day. Have an amazing week. Have an amazing year. Have a flipping awesome one, my darling. I hope you love your lockdown and you're just, yeah, you're just doing your damn thing. Have an amazing day, guys. Bye. <laughs>